In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to fix a hard drive that is not detecting to your computer. Okay, now there are several things that you can try first. Basically, try a different USB port, also update your USB drivers. Go to Device Manager, make sure the USB drivers are updated. Make sure the power supply is working if you're using an enclosure and the hard drive is spinning and everything is working correctly. Also reboot your computer, that may also be the problem. Now if you tried all these things and it's still not working, you have to check Device Manager. Now I'm currently using an enclosure. This is a 3.5 inch hard drive with an enclosure and I'm connecting it to the computer. So I'm going to plug this in. I'm going to plug the hard drive into the USB port of the computer. Okay, so as you just heard, the computer detected it. Okay, let's check the computer and see if it's there. And as you can see, it's not there. It's just detecting the computer's hard drive. The external hard drive is not being detected. Okay, so the next thing you need to do is go to Device Manager. Now you need to go to disk drives. Now as you can see, it's detected. In Device Manager, it actually detects the hard drive. It's a Western Digital Drive. As you can see, it's right there. And it's a USB device. It's plugged in via the USB. I can hear the hard drive spinning. The enclosure is on. Everything is working, but the computer is not detecting it. Okay, so here's what you have to do. You have to go to disk management okay now, as you can see, the hard drive is not in the main list, but it's all the way at the bottom. See, it says disk one unknown. That's the disk that is not being detected. So, make sure to always look at the bottom. Don't look over here and say, oh, the disk is not there and it's not being detected. Where is it? You have to look at the bottom. And right over here, you can see, here's the disk. Okay, what you need to do is click on disk one. Now, right click. Go to initialize disk. Now what you need to do is with this checked off master boot record go to OK. Now right click go to new simple volume next next okay so it's going to assign a name to it so in this case it's going to be D next okay so it's going to format the drive now keep in mind when it's formatted it's going to erase all the data on the hard drive so you have to keep that in mind so go to next finish and there you go it's complete. Now let's go back to the computer. And as you can see, there's the hard drive. It's been detected. There you go. That is how to fix a hard drive that is not detecting to the computer. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please show your support for this channel by subscribing. Feel free to leave comments. Please like up this video and thank you for tuning in.